If you're exploring AI art tools beyond the usual, Open Art AI has been turning heads uh, lately, but does it live up to the hype? Let's break it down. So what is it? It's a browser-based platform that converts prompts or sketches into polished artwork, and it uses Dolly 3 and Stable Diffusion, which is amazing. It offers in-painting, upscaling, object editing, and even video generation capabilities. So basically, uh, I mean, the UI is pretty nice, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, you can just search by prompt. Let's see if we can actually make an image. A fox in a meadow. All right, Does, is it gonna generate anything right now? Of course, it's gonna ask me to pay right away. What are the pricing? You get 14.5 per seat per month for the advanced one, infinite 28 per seat per month in team, you get 17.45 per seat per month. So it's got a user-friendly interface, as I mentioned. Uh, clear navigation, built-in tutorials. It's great for beginners. All in one tune set. From sketch to image and training custom models to advanced editing features. All in one. Also, cost transparency. Offers a free plan with starter credits, which apparently I did not get. Um, apart from that, it's a pay-as-you-go GPU pricing. $0.25 per hour. So you're not locked into big monthly fees. All right, what are the cons then? Erratic image output. So apparently the images can be weird. Um, it's got stories. Wow, that's crazy. Um, they've got questionable support and refund policies and video tools are still rough. The images are better. Uh, Open Art AI is appealing if you want a polished beginner friendly AI art workflow with plenty of styles and editing built in. But if you need reliable output, responsive support and consistent results, especially for complex prompts, you may be a bit disappointed.